yeah welcome once again to rancho solution video tutorial um i'm gonna tutor the group three on this their assignments i titled it um annual growth population so remember this video was being made by two friends rancho and gandhi berry so let's get to the question so the question simply says supposing that the annual state university have an extra growth in its student population for for the past 12 years at the rate of 26.5 percent annually develop a chart that would display the growth if the initial growth at a goal was 3500 students using a bar chart and a stock chart so let's see how we're going to calculate the 26.5 percent annually to get the 3,500 students, how they were being increased. So, um, in our calculation, uh, we find out that uh, to get this done, just to get the 26.5% of 3,500 students, we now have that 3,500 times 26.5 all over 100. We simply give, give us 928 students. So, note, um every year they increase by 928 students so let's see how we're going to put this thing in a cell in shots thank you yeah so to open up your microsoft excel you go to your start menu click all programs and go to microsoft office click on it and choose microsoft excel 2007 yeah and your program will open up so here i've already um solved the solution to the question so but i want you guys to know how to do this and do it on your own so um on how to fix this stock chart and bar chart up so let's get started i click on um sh my sheet sheet two to get a new sheet yeah so actually this is my data according to the question is starting from 2002 to 2014 that's the present year and then the population from 2002 is 3500 now um for the 26.5 the degree annually simply means that we are going to be adding the 3500 by 928 students and when we add this is going to give us 4482 students and you will keep on adding keep on adding and keep on adding and you get to 15,284 for the 2014 so let's um put this thing in a chart so first of all let's um make um use of a stock a stock charts so in a stock uh, start you just highlight this click insert and choose other charts all chart types um you go to stock and make use of this one if you try to make use use of this is not going to work if you try to make use of this is not going to work and if you try to make use of the volume uh open high low close is is, is is not going to work the only one that is going to work is going to be this one a high low close and you click on it and click ok and the thing will now display so actually here let's put our title bar so put your title bar make sure you, you get to your chart tools choose um lay out your chart title above the chart so here we're supposed to name the distance something like um school population so so that is it now to put your axis you go to axis types um make it to be um title below the axis so here i uh, will call it a a stock shot is actually a stock shot so um let's edit it to a size that is a little bit big so that is it and you try to increase the size of this thing and now um you can change the design you go to design you choose a very better design like this now for us to make these numbers to be the year of uh the year of the data to change it you just um um click here light click 
and say select data so when you select a data you choose the year because you actually want to modify the year and you click edit so in the year you now put 2000 2001 2002,2003,2004,2005,2006,2007,2008,2009,2010,2011,2012,2013,2014 So this is the actual year from 2002 to 2014 you okay it and okay it here too so you when you look at this place you now see that it's being categorized based on the years so these are the numbers um the, now for us to put for the population so that the population will be showing out if you want you can modify these ones to be your population but i want it to be apply uh appear appearing in this arrow rows you now click on this place right click and uh, now um we click on this arrow right click and say add a data label it will actually uh, add a data label that's based on the population that they uh, were being increased if you want to make this thing happens you do the same thing that i did here so that is for the um for the stock chart now for the bar charts you highlight from year to the population number and click insert and choose the bar chart to the bar i actually give you this you know drag and bring it here so now yeah we are good to go so here let's put our bar title so bar you go to design um to layout Sh um put here um now put um school population so and that is it so we can have this now to change these numbers to what you want it to be so the actual year that you want it to be is simply you click on these things right click and now see select data so here you choose on the year and edit so you now have this so you, you now enter from 2002 to 2014 and okay it and okay it here so you can now find out that um from 2014 is now showing the numbers that is supposed to be showing uh you can make it to be big so that every data will be showing up so here uh we now have this and that is what you, you can put your as is um let it be below and uh, you now say inside it that this is actually a bar shot this is actually a bar shot you like highlight on it um increase the size to 16 to make it big so this is actually a bar shot so it's good now to put in the population number you like like you like click and say add data labels and we actually add the the population so you can see the population of the school how they increased so you can make this thing very beautiful by going to design to put a very better view of it so you now have this so it's good so you can with this is okay you can make it in i'm still i'm still your friend rank show thank you